Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing from Parks Racing, Ben Salem, Pennsylvania on Saturday afternoon, January the 21st, and this is my dayatthetrack.com thoroughbred race of the day. Let's take a look at race 8 this afternoon, folks, here at Parks, 322 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mile test on the dirt track, four-year-olds and up race for an optional claiming prize of some $50,000. Contenders number four, Norman Asbornson, number five, Hermo Silo, number three, Rustler Hustler, and number seven, Winchell. Number two, Norman Aborson has won half of his six starts to date, racing at today's distance of a mile on the dirt. Is the pace profile leader. He's hit the board in power run fashion in three of his last four starts, including a power run win in his fourth race back. Jockey Julian Pimentel and trainer Chris Grove sent him to the post. They've hit the board with 55% of their entries saddles the team to date. Number five, Hermo Silo, at eight to one shot, qualifies as a track master plus power pony, takes a two level class drop, has won three of his last five outings with two of those circle trips, also qualifying as power run wins. Race eight summary number two, Norman S. Bordson tops my contenders list today, which also includes number five, Hermo Silo, number three, Rustler Hustler, and number seven, Winchell. That's Two five three seven in the eight from Parks Racing. Bonus long shots: Beulah Park in Ohio, race eight. The speed honors in this claiming field are shared by the ten to one bomb. Number eight, call me now in the four to one shot. Number nine, Philly Frenzy. Charlestown racing tonight, race six. Number two, Miss Wishbone, six to one in the morning line. Qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony. Takes a 13-level class drop. Nice overall speed for this four and one half for a long sprint. So from Parks Racing, I still call it Philadelphia Park, Rick Needham. For dayatthetrack.com on a Saturday afternoon, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.